Good morning, everyone. I'm Larry with TransWest Truck Trailer RV. We're located in Frederick, Colorado. It's a little bit cooler out this morning and that puts everybody in a better mood. We've been under a heat spell for a little while and it, it feels good to cool down. It really does. So the inventory item we're going to take a look at today is a trade-in. Um, it's one that has had some aftermarket things done to it. You know that not only it increases it aesthetically, but it really increases it from a practicality and longevity standpoint as well. This is a 2019 Ram 3500. The truck has just a touch over 15,000 miles. The wheelbase for this truck is 160.5 inches. Comes with a curb weight of 7,326 pounds. The GVWR on this truck is 11,400. So we'll start today by taking a look directly in front of the vehicle. The first thing that grabs you is one of the aftermarket things is this grill guard right here. I like it from the standpoint that it's not one of those extremely large overbearing guards. It's just the one that's kind of going to protect things, especially, you know, where you live. I mean, if you live in an area where deer are prevalent, things like that, that'll help protect the truck. We see the large Ram logo, a really big grill because as you know, that engine underneath that hood demands that. There's a camera located here. In addition, there's sensors all over it. Here, 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 and here as well. The truck comes with LED lights. Now we'll take a look under the hood. Really an engine that doesn't need much introduction at all. That's the Cummins 6.7 liter. It offers 370 horsepower, 850 foot-pounds of torque. It is coupled with the Iason AS69RC transmission. Ram has been putting Iason transmissions in the trucks since 2007. Really a combination that works extremely well. This is stock number 5U210944. As we take a look at the tires, you'll see those are the aftermarket rims. These are Pathfinder All Terrains T29470R18s. Now, if we just step back and take a complete shot of the truck, as you can see, it does have a leveling kit on it. So the truck is dead level. So that's an extra add-on that really improves the way the truck looks as well. I mean, it is completely level. As we take a look inside the driver's seat, as we can see, we have the Magnum steps to help us get up and in. WeatherTech floor mats. A couple of things to notice from here. Here's where we would adjust the pedals to the truck. Adjust our seat right here. In addition, the mirrors collapse it's just by pushing that button right there and back to our normal spot. We take a look at the back seat. This pops up and it has this extender here to come out and down like that. That helps protect underneath as well. As we look at the bed of the truck, this is a long box. So it's a little bit longer than what we're used to seeing. But from a practicality standpoint, very good as well for obviously for cargo things of that nature and hooking up gooseneck trailers. 
Underneath here is our fuel tank and the def tank. The truck comes with a toolbox located right here. And from the rear, we'll be able to see that a touch better. Now, let's take a look directly behind the truck. The trim package on this is Bighorn. It tells us that right here. The traditional Ram logo located here and 4x4. The truck does come with a tow package located right there. Plus, here's our hookups for the bumper pull. There's a backup camera located right there. Now, let's take a look at the bed. As you can see, it's lined. The bed is lined, but also that's a toolbox is a weather guard. So that's protected as well. So I mentioned things in terms of longevity. Having everything lined like this is really gonna be able to keep things nice for a long time. Right here's our hookup for gooseneck or fifth wheel. In addition, there's lights on each side. As we continue to walk around, we can really, from the three-quarter shot, see the length of the bed and how that is going to be more, more functional for a lot of people having it that bed instead of the shorter one. You know, one thing I would like to visit about is why buy from TransWest? Well, there's a couple of reasons. One, TransWest has been selling trucks from the early 1990s and really put in a high emphasis on integrity and honesty. Go to any uh, search you want, look at the reviews, they'll all pretty much say the same thing. So you're buying from a company you know you can trust, and I think that's very important when purchasing a vehicle. When we take a look at the back seat, we notice how much room is back here. The vents are located there, and a couple of charging ports located right there. This side of the seat comes up, very similar to what the other side does, with the extra protection right there. A couple of cup holders right in the middle. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. The truck has push button start. Now let's start at the top and work our way down. As you can see, this truck comes with a sunroof. That button opens and closes that. The one in the middle is for the cargo lamp located right behind us. And this opens the back of the sunroof easily closed right there if we don't want anything at all. Over here is for garage door openers. We can program that right there. As we come on down, we see the Ram logo. <coughs> now, one thing I like about this truck is the size of the screen. It's not one of those real tiny ones, but it's not really huge either. So it's kind of in that middle. So let's take a look at the backup camera right there. We're gonna have a couple of options. Obviously, that's to hook up the bumper pull Right there is simply a different view of it. Now the camera will also show what's going on in front of us as well. And there's a camera right there if you have gooseneck or fifth wheel. Even though the seats aren't leather, they are, you can make them heated right there. Simply turn that on or off. And there's a couple of different levels to that. The steering wheel is also heated. Now that's on Uconnect, so that's the that's the one that all the Chrysler products have. So you can basically get everything you need from here. Right there is our, our cargo cam that we took a look at just a bit ago. You can also reach it reach it right there. We can go to radio. This it does as you can see right there comes with Sirius, so you can hook that up if you choose to. As we come on down, 
right here is our mute button and you can shut the screen completely off if you want to. Our hazards are located here. Traction control is this button. You can also do heated seats and steering wheel from this right here. As we come on down, here's our tow package located right here, our, tra our trailer brake, I'm sorry, trailer brake located right here, exhaust brake here. Now we can have parking sensors on both front and rear if we want to. There's a couple of charge ports located here. Now you are able to charge your phone right here. Simply slide the phone in right here and that's gonna charge us while we're doing our travels. The console is huge. It goes all the way down to here. Plus, we can move that up. Open this up, there's storage room here. And this pops up here. So we have even more storage located right there. I did want to mention that not only do we sell trucks here at TransWest, but we purchase them as well. So if you're trying to get rid of either a pickup truck or a hauler, feel free to give us a call and we can see what we can do along those lines. But if you're interested in this truck, please give me a call. My cell phone number is 970-370-4067. The work extension 303-684-3404. Feel free to email me at larry.vickers at transwest.com. Thanks for tuning in today.